Passion Travel is a channel specializing in all things travel street food and subscribe if you like the content. Suya. Grilled skewered meat, commonly made with beef, chicken, or goat, seasoned with spices and served with onions and tomatoes. Suya is a popular street food and spicy grilled meat delicacy that originated in Nigeria but is also commonly enjoyed in other West African countries, including Equatorial Guinea. It is loved for its intense flavors and tender, succulent texture. Suya is typically made with beef, but it can also be prepared with other meats like chicken, goat, or even fish. Here's an overview of how suya is typically prepared. Meat selection. The key ingredient for suya is thinly sliced and preferably lean meat. Beef is the most common choice, but other meats can also be used. Marination. The meat is marinated in a mixture of ground peanuts or peanut butter, spices, and other seasonings. The peanut-based marinade is what gives suya its distinctive flavor and nutty aroma. Spices commonly used include ginger, garlic, cayenne pepper, paprika, and ground-roasted peanuts. Skewering. The marinated meat is then threaded onto skewers, either as individual pieces or in chunks, ready for grilling. Spice coating. Before grilling, the skewered meat is often coated with an additional layer of the peanut spice mixture to intensify the flavor. Grilling. Suya is traditionally cooked on open grills, over hot charcoal or wood, which imparts a smoky flavor to the meat. The meat is grilled until it is cooked through and has a slightly charred and crispy exterior. Serving. Suya is typically served hot and is often enjoyed as a standalone snack or as a main course. It is commonly served with sliced onions, tomatoes, and spicy peppers on the side. Some vendors also offer a sprinkle of additional suya spice mix for those who prefer an extra kick. Suya is a popular street food in Equatorial Guinea and other West African countries, where it is sold by street vendors and at local markets. It is a delightful and flavorful treat, loved for its rich taste, spicy kick, and the unique combination of roasted peanuts and aromatic spices. Whether enjoyed as a quick snack or as part of a meal, suya is a must-try for anyone exploring the diverse flavors of West African cuisine. Grilled fish. Fresh fish grilled over an open flame or on a barbecue, often seasoned with spices. Grilled fish is a popular and delicious street food enjoyed in many parts of the world, including Equatorial Guinea. As a coastal country, Equatorial Guinea is known for its fresh seafood, and grilled fish is a delightful way to savor the natural flavors of the ocean. Here's an overview of how grilled fish is typically prepared. Choice of fish. The key ingredient for grilled fish is, of course, fresh fish. In Equatorial Guinea, various types of fish are used, depending on availability and local preferences. Common choices include snapper, grouper, tilapia, or other locally caught fish with firm and flaky flesh. Cleaning and seasoning. The fish is thoroughly cleaned, gutted, and often scaled. It may be lightly scored on both sides to help the seasonings penetrate. The fish is then seasoned with a blend of herbs, spices, and sometimes a marinade, which may include ingredients like garlic, ginger, lemon or lime juice, and a mix of aromatic herbs. Grilling. The seasoned fish is placed on a hot grill, typically over an open flame or on a barbecue. The grilling process imparts a smoky flavor to the fish, and the high heat creates a slightly crispy and charred exterior. Flipping and cooking time. The fish is carefully flipped to ensure even cooking on both sides. The cooking time varies depending on the thickness and size of the fish, but it is essential not to overcook it to maintain its moisture and tenderness. Serving. Grilled fish is usually served hot and can be enjoyed as is or with a variety of accompaniments. It is commonly served with a side of rice, plantains, or a fresh salad. Some regions may offer sauces or dips to complement the flavors of the fish. Grilled fish is a popular and healthy street food choice, loved for its simplicity and delicious taste. Whether enjoyed by the beach or in local markets, grilling fish is a culinary tradition that allows locals and visitors in Equatorial Guinea to savor the bounty of the sea and experience the country's vibrant coastal cuisine. Okra soup. A flavorful soup made with okra, tomatoes, and various meats or fish. Okra soup also known as, gombo, or, okra stew, is a flavorful and hearty dish enjoyed in many West African countries, including Equatorial Guinea. It is made with okra, a vegetable known for its thickening properties, which gives the soup its characteristic texture. Here's an overview of how okra soup is typically prepared. Okra. The key ingredient for okra soup is fresh okra. The okra pods are washed, trimmed, and sliced before being added to the soup. Choice of meat. 
okra soup can be made with various meats, such as chicken, beef, fish, or seafood, depending on personal preferences and availability. Vegetables. In addition to okra, the soup often includes other vegetables like onions, tomatoes, and leafy greens such as spinach or kale. Seasonings. The soup is seasoned with a blend of spices and herbs, which may include garlic, ginger, thyme, and sometimes a chili pepper or hot pepper for a hint of heat. Cooking. The meat is typically first cooked in a pot with some oil until it browns and becomes tender. Onions and other vegetables are added and sautéed until softened. The okra is then added, and the mixture is simmered until the okra becomes tender and releases its natural mucilage, which helps to thicken the soup. Broth. The soup is typically cooked in a flavorful broth, which can be made with water, meat or vegetable stock, or a combination of both. Adjusting flavors. Seasonings and spices are adjusted to taste, ensuring the soup is balanced and delicious. Serving. Okra soup is usually served hot and is commonly accompanied by a side of rice, fufu, a starchy side dish made from pounded cassava or plantains, or other staple foods. Okra soup is a beloved dish in Equatorial Guinea and other West African countries, where it is enjoyed as a comforting and nourishing meal. Its thick and hearty texture, along with the combination of vegetables and meat, makes it a satisfying option for locals and a delightful introduction to the flavors of West African cuisine for visitors. Poulet DG. A popular Cameroonian dish with chicken, plantains, and vegetables cooked in a spicy sauce. Poulet DG, short for Poulet Directeur General, is a popular and flavorful chicken dish that originates from Cameroon but is also enjoyed in neighboring countries, including Equatorial Guinea. The name, Poulet Directeur General, translates to Chicken General Manager, in French, suggesting that it is a dish fit for high-ranking officials or anyone deserving of a special treat. Here's an overview of how Poulet DG is typically prepared. Chicken. The key ingredient for Poulet DG is, of course, chicken. Chicken pieces, such as drumsticks or chicken thighs, are commonly used for this dish. Seasoning. The chicken is seasoned with a blend of spices and herbs, such as garlic, ginger, thyme, and a mix of aromatic seasonings. Sautéing. The seasoned chicken is sautéed in a pot with some oil until it is browned and partially cooked. Vegetables. Various vegetables are added to the pot, including sliced onions, bell peppers, and carrots. The vegetables are sautéed with the chicken, absorbing its flavors. Plantains. One of the highlights of Poulet DG is the addition of ripe plantains, which add sweetness and balance to the savory dish. The plantains are usually sliced and added to the pot. Spices and sauces. Poulet DG often includes tomato paste or fresh tomatoes, which add depth and color to the dish. Additional spices and seasonings are adjusted to taste, ensuring a well-balanced flavor profile. Simmering. The dish is simmered on low heat, allowing all the flavors to melt together and the chicken and vegetables to become tender. Garnishing. Poulet DG is often garnished with chopped green onions or parsley for added freshness and a pop of color. Serving. Poulet DG is typically served hot and is often accompanied by a side of rice, plantains, or another starchy dish. Poulet DG is a delicious and comforting chicken dish that is loved for its rich and aromatic flavors. It is a special treat often served at celebrations, gatherings, or when hosting guests. Whether enjoyed in Cameroon, Equatorial Guinea, or elsewhere, Poulet DG offers a delightful taste of West African cuisine and is a dish that is sure to satisfy and impress. Fish Moambe. Fish cooked in a palm nut sauce, popular in Central and West Africa. Fish Moambe, also known as Fish Moambe, or Fish in Palm Nut Sauce, is a popular and traditional dish enjoyed in Equatorial Guinea and other Central and West African countries. It is a flavorful fish stew made with fish and cooked in a rich and creamy sauce made from palm nuts. Here's an overview of how fish moambe is typically prepared. Fish. The main ingredient for fish moambe is fresh fish, often whole or cut into large chunks. In Equatorial Guinea, various types of fish may be used, depending on availability and regional preferences. Palm nut sauce. The unique and essential element of fish moambe is the palm nut sauce. Palm nuts are processed to extract their creamy, reddish-orange oil, which is used as the base for the sauce. The palm nut oil gives the stew its characteristic color and flavor. Tomatoes and vegetables. The stew is typically enriched with the addition of tomatoes, onions, and sometimes other vegetables such as bell peppers or spinach. These ingredients add depth and complexity to the dish. Seasonings. 
Fish moambe is seasoned with a blend of spices and herbs, which may include garlic, ginger, thyme, bay leaves, and other aromatic seasonings. Some variations may also include chili peppers or hot spices for a hint of heat. Simmering. The fish is first cooked in the palm nut sauce and seasoned with the spices and vegetables. The stew is then simmered on low heat, allowing the flavors to meld together and the fish to cook gently in the rich and creamy sauce. Adjusting flavors. Seasonings and spices are adjusted to taste, ensuring the stew is well-balanced and flavorful. Serving. Fish moambe is typically served hot and is often accompanied by a side of rice, fufu, a starchy side dish made from pounded cassava or plantains, or another staple food. Fish moambe is a beloved dish in Equatorial Guinea and other West African countries, where it is enjoyed as a comforting and satisfying meal. The combination of tender fish, creamy palm nut sauce, and a medley of vegetables and spices makes it a delightful representation of the diverse and flavorful cuisine of the region.